In the meantime, here's another real American voice. His name is Loza Alexander. Uh, he's a recording artist who's become a big sensation by taking on Joe Biden, by supporting Donald Trump. Uh, he's got a wonderful song called Let's Go Brandon that you've probably heard. He joins us live right now. Good morning, Loza. Okay. Did you hear him? No, I can't hear him. Okay, guys. Do we have him out there? Good morning. Yeah. Okay, now I hear you, uh, Loza. We can hear you now. Uh, what's That's it like cool. being uh, kind of a Trump-supporting recording artist right now uh, in this sort of cancel culture world? I'm looking at some of your songs. In addition to Let's Go, Brandon, you've now got a song about Elon Musk that people can download at Apple Music and everywhere. Uh, Dear Trump. You know, Musk has become someone who's taking on the Biden White House. He wants to buy Twitter uh, and make sure it becomes more fair for conservatives. What's it like being a recording artist who supports Donald Trump uh, in this cancel culture right now? I mean, it feels really good. It feels amazing. You know, a lot of people, you know, need, need this. You know, a lot of people need their voices heard. A lot of people aren't able to get their voices heard. And, you know, using my platform and my voice to be able to bring it out, it's an amazing feeling. You know, a lot of artists right now aren't putting out the truth, but I feel like it's being... It's getting, you know, to a point where people aren't going to have a choice, you know, these artists and stuff like that, man. So just opening up a new wave is it, it's the best thing ever. It really is. Loza, it was super impressive. You know, it was just days from the time of the chant at the NASCAR race when the Let's Go Brandon phrase became so famous that you wrote and produced and came out with this song. What was that process like? Man, it, it was incredible. I mean, you know, the interview when I watched it, it, it was hilarious, you know, and it's using my skills to be able to sample it, you know, sampling her voice and stuff like that. And then, you know, sampling the, the, the crowd. I, I I didn't know it, blow, it would blow up that big, but it, it was a lot of adrenaline going on, you know, making a record. Like, I really felt something special was there. And uh, because it was like how everybody's feeling, how they still feel, you know what I mean? And I knew it would be something special, man. But it was it was incredible that it just blew up the way it did. And I just woke up one morning on Fox News like, what? <laughs> like, what's going on? Um, so, yeah, it, it was definitely amazing. Well, now you're on Real America's Voice. Uh, the song Dear Trump. Uh, what do you say to him there? Uh, and what's your kind of message? We had a big election night last night. A lot of Trump backed candidates uh, won. Uh, others like Dr. Oz are still in the kind of a dead heat in Pennsylvania. We're on top of that. Uh, but we're heading into a midterm election where Trump backed candidates seem to have a head of steam. And you know, that, that that's an incredible thing in itself. You know what I mean? And um, I feel like a lot of these records that I did, especially like, you know, Dear Trump, it's coming back up the surface and people are, are seeing, like, you know, the appreciation that I felt. But not only that, I mean, obviously, it's everyone else's voices, too, as well. And, and um, you know, it's being brought up back to surface again. And, you know, I definitely want to be able to, you know, put my two cents in and, you know, find out as much important information as possible and, and you know, bring it to a form of art. Um, you know, and I feel like it's going to influence a lot of young, you know, the younger generation as well you know, to vote in the right people, because right now it's a very crucial time to, uh, to do that, obviously, because they're trying to turn our country into a communist country, you know what I mean? So, um, but yeah, it's it, it's it's an incredible feeling, and it's looking forward to continue putting the, the truth out there. That's great. I want, I want to hear some of these songs. I want to hear some of the songs, and I know that the Let's Go Brandon's got some lyrics that we can't yeah, can sing we get here the clean on version of Let's Go Brandon? Version? We get a little bit of that? Uh, I don't have the clean version handy on me right now. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie to you, but, but yeah. <laughs> All right, but g give us a few of the lyrics. So, what are some of the clean lyrics? Give, give us a little bit of it. Hold on, I got it right here. I don't know if you guys can hear it. He said, but can you sing it? We want to hear you. Sing. You know what they said? Nobody. You know what they saying? Joe Biden. Yeah, I say, you know what they saying? Joe Biden. Yeah. Hey, you know what they saying? Hey, you know what they saying? Hey, you know what they... You know what they... They're going to verse y'all up. Sing it with me, y'all at home. And I say it with a passion as I pull up in the Aston. Don't nobody like it. So try to cover up until the people go, Brandon. We know what they saying, though. No. 
You can hear the chant in every post. Don't nobody want this comedy because he's not in China. Everybody hated Trump, and now they out to catch a body. That's what they get for treating us like we in square games. Green light, mandate, like he's insane. These times, people waking up to everything. Go Brandon, but we all know what the saying means. Joe Biden. Yeah, I said, you know what they said, so. <laughs> I felt like it was a morning and you were you had a slow we were trying to get the engine going and then the Aston Martin all of a sudden was like purring it turned it right up and you just turned it on and now people see why you're a recording artist that has been a great sensation yeah. Lowe's to Alexander we'll have you back uh, check him out Apple Music Spotify all the rest you can download it uh, he's on fire you can see why Loza, thank you for coming on that was awesome thanks so much thanks Appreciate you guys for having me. Thank you.